here from our protection dogs and Billy Bones. Very excited to start. Okay, so today we're going to do the start of your down stay. So obviously your dog needs to know how to down first before you can do the down stay. So today again we're just doing the first few steps of how to start it. So Billy has never done it, he's only done downs. So we're going to show you how we do the first steps for our down. So same as with the sit stay, um, keep it short. Your distance, our first goal is just to be able to step away from him, step back in. If that is too much for your dog, it can also be just like putting your one foot away and putting the one back. That could be your first step. So don't try to do a stay where you like five meters away from your dog because that's not going to work. So remember your markers. And then with a down stay is we're going to gradually make it longer and longer because our down stays are usually our long stays where we can do long downs. It is also a great control exercise, especially later in your protection, to down him, to get them calm, to get them under control. So let's start with Billy. Billy, come. Sit. Down. Good. Uh -uh. Down. Good. Down. Ah. Down. Ah. Good. Ah. Uh -uh. Down. Good. Good boy. Ah. Uh -uh. Down. Good boy. So I make him wait until I'm back next to him. Ah. Uh -uh. Down. Ah. Uh. Good. Okay, and then also I watch his body language. If I see he's going to get up, I try to give my negative marker even before he makes the mistake. Sit. Good. Down. Ah, uh -uh. down. Good. Good. Good boy. So once again, I'm giving my first step with my right leg. A, hey, down. Ah, uh -uh. sit, down. Good. Good. So the mistakes people make is they always reward the dog on the way back, and then they learn to get up. Sit, down. Good. You can also give your stay command there. Good boy. So you can say down, stay. Uh uh, down, stay. Good. I just use down, so my dogs, I'll use sit, means sit in that, stay in that position. Down means stay in that position. Down. Good. Okay. And then always break your stays. Don't allow the dog to get up on their own because you forgot about it. Sit. Down. Good. Down. Ah, uh, down. Good. So he lifted up his elbows a bit, so it needs to stay on the ground. So Billy is doing really well, so we progress to even having a whole step out. But if your session is basically just doing this and going back in without your dog getting up, that's also fine. Or um, down. Sometimes it is also just, if you're still luring, it's just being able to do this. Ah, uh -uh. you see, down. Just ah, uh. standing up, going back down. So just rewarding him for keeping the position might be your first step. Uh-uh. Down. Good. Okay. Good boy. 
so I am using my markers the whole time to tell him he's doing something wrong, like when he starts to get up and stuff. So then it's really clear for him, and it's also not stressful because he understands what I want. Down. Good. Ah, ah, down. Good. So I won't reward him there. <coughs> I'll just do it again. Good. Good boy. <coughs> Sit. So we don't have to go and physically correct the dog and physically try to keep him in that down position, come back and get upset. If you just do it and teach him what it actually means, the down stage shouldn't be such an issue or such a big confrontation for the dog. Sit. Good. Down. Good. Good boy. Uh-uh. Down. Good. Good. So he doesn't really understand what we want. So he's allowed to make mistakes. He tries to get up, see what I want from him. So I'm not going to physically reprimand him there and shout at him because he, he doesn't understand. So by just staying calm and telling him yes or no with my markers, I can get him to do the right things. Down. Uh -uh, down. Good. Good boy. Uh uh, down, good. Good, good boy. Sit. I think it's also important for him to be able to fix it himself. Like, if I give him the negative marker and he fixes it and I mark it again, he knows how to fix it. So, if he ever does break it and you just say, no, go down, they fix it. You don't have to go walk or march back there, put the dog in it down. You know, it's just unnecessary. So te teach your dog to think and to know exactly what you want. Billy, Billy, don't get so distracted. Do you want to ask nicely? No. Okay, so I think, <laughs> good, that's it for the down stay. So let me know how it goes. If you guys have any problems, just let us know. Cheers. Good. Good boy.